What's going on guys? In this video, we're gonna be breaking down the best coaching adjustments that you can use on the defensive side of the ball to give yourself a little bit of an advantage in Madden 22. Now, if you're new to the channel, my name is Cody and I wanna thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If this is your first time visiting my channel, my channel focuses in on helping people become the best Madden players they can become. We do that through uploading videos every single day that can help you get better at Madden on both sides of the ball, including the defense. And kind of wanted to let you know that we're actually Feeling a little bit better about defense. We've spent all night in practice mode here. Uh, and when I say practice mode for defense, you want to be practicing and labbing in game because you cannot do coaching adjustments in practice mode. And that's a big negative in my personal opinion. So I like to lab my defense in game. And I wanted to share with you um, the coaching adjustments. So how you do this is you're just going to click your right joystick in and take a look at these coaching adjustments that I like to use. So we're, first things first, we're going to start with auto flip on. Now, if you don't, if you have a certain blitz that you like to use with auto flip off, that's understandable, but generally I like to have this on. Auto alignment, this is gonna be set to default, again, unless very specific um, setup requires it to be base aligned or main aligned, but generally I like to run with default this year. Ball and air defense, and this is a really important one. Last year, for the most part, we played it play ball. What I like to do this year is swap ball. And the reason I like to use swap ball is because defense is really hard in this game. And if you're not careful, you'll try to go for interceptions whenever you shouldn't. And I just find swap ball to be effective. And what'll happen is you actually have linebackers that are underneath routes. They'll actually jump up and swat the ball, even though they wouldn't do that if it was a, if it was on play ball, okay? Uh, cornerback matchups, these are gonna be on balance. Option defense, this is really important. We're gonna put this on conservative. And what this is gonna do is if ever a quarterback option, they're always, the, the computer or the defense is always gonna focus on the quarterback meaning that's gonna leave your responsibility to basically just blow up the running back. Strip ball, I actually leave this typically on conservative. If you take a look here, um, if I put it on aggressive, you're gonna see here that there's a high chance for AI to attempt to strip for a higher fumble, but there's also a chance of the face mask penalty. There's really no, um, if you take a look here, uh, if I put it on conservative, there is lower break tackle chances, but the con of that is that the AI will not attempt to strip. So you can kind of do whatever you want. I personally, um, I personally like to go ahead and do this on, on um, conservative or on balance. Last but not least, tackling, we like to put this on conservative. And then the last thing I wanna let you know about is our zone drops. What I like to do for my zone drops here is I like to go with zone drops on, my flats are on 10, my curl flats are on 30, and my hook curls are on, are on uh, 10. The reason that I like to do it this way is because last year we actually flipped this. We put the curl flats on 30 and the flats on 10. The reason I like to do this this year this way is because the flat routes are really good in Madden 22. And so uh, I find that the flat zone, hard flat zone or curl flat zone does a little bit better of a job at defending those quick throws than the curl flats do. Now, if you want to you go back to this, you certainly can, but this is in general how I like to start the game as far as a zone drop cocktail. Um, you could even bump these down to 25, but from what I've been labbing, the best crossing routes in the game and the best corner routes in the game these need to be on 30 if you want to stop them with zone drops. So anyways, guys, this is kind of my default coaching adjustments. It's what I use uh, in my games. And if you have any questions about it, feel free to text the word Madden to 208-218-6900. You can get uh, access to my free uh, offenses and defenses that I release the community. And it's also a great way for you to engage with me, ask your Madden questions, whatever I can do to help you. I look forward to it. Uh, but anyways, guys, I want to thank you for watching this video. Again, these are the best zone drops, the best defensive adjustments that I've found so far. And we're going to be continuing to lab defense because, man, defense is tough this year. But I think we've got some stuff that's going to really help you out over the course of the next day or two. You're going to start being able to uh, have some success defensively. So thanks for watching this video. And, again, if you want to get my free offenses and defenses, uh, my offensive and defensive guides that I release every single week to the Madden community, all you have to do is text the word Madden to 208 218-6900. Thanks for watching.